Well, hello and welcome back to Coliseum. Episode 106. And the last two weeks, well, the, the beginning of the new season of the Coliseum. Some things we changed before the new season. I say we, I. Um, uh, I'm going to kind of make it look nicer, make it look prettier. And uh, we got the new, well, for the last... 10 episodes or so, we've had the new FTX Cedar, uh, logo, the new Coliseum look, uh, and we're going to try to have a more fun time. Now we have four classic matches, we're kind of getting ready to our next pay-per-view glory, um, which won't be for another few, <laughs> um, couple of weeks. Odyssey is back, and here it is, it was Princess Peach versus Spoiler, and the roster is getting on the way as well. So the next few weeks we'll have a full rosters. Have you wrestled in Coliseum or Od uh, Coliseum or the Odyssey Arenas uh, uh, last week? You were on that roster. Later on we'll have the Team Pop. It was the Halloween Saints for Tile Shot. Against Big Body and Lord Muscle at our next pay-per-view. We also have Supergirl who defeated by Kano She-Hulk in a number contention match with a Valkyrie title against Raven. And the main event, a triple threat match by the number contender for Spider-Man's new FCW Championship. Red Hood vs. Nate Gray vs. Varel Zod. Spoiler, former member of the Titans, former... Batwoman, Batgirl. Uh, sorry, former Robin. She dresses the bat. And former FCW champion. Oh, she's trained by Beast Boy and Robin. Oh, nice, right into a pinfall. Where last week, um, last week, the week previous, they were screwed out. Really, of the IC Titan titles in a first blood elimination match against Hulk and Apocalypse. Last week we saw Spider Girl, um, Starfire, and Spider Man become the new champions. Every title was successfully defended except them two. Hopefully, with this season four, there'll be no delays, no nothing. Just Good clean fun once again. Ah, oh, power slam from Princess Peach, who debuted some time ago. Jim Cornette has picked her in the, the draft. It's not like the first draft where there's big announcements, it's literally they've just picking by week by week. I know there's some, gonna be some compromise. But uh, we'll be finding out know, what's the full roster. We're just staying tuned. Ah, Razor's Edge into a sit down power bomb. The spoiler. <coughs> uh, Princess Peach. Boom! Burst and goes for a spear taken. Spoiler out of her boots. Only a two. Stomp to the belly welly. Knocking her back, going after the leg. <coughs> Ooh, now working on both arms. And there's an arm bar on to Princess Peach, oh, and Princess Peach getting up and wailing on Spike like to break free. Oh, 
That was a weird glitch for the claw. And it's gone Magna. Oh, picking her up. It looks like a pinfall, but now into an arm bar and a leg bar. Oh. Submission onto Princess Peach. And Princess Peach picking up spoilers, slamming her down. Us Baton Ram. Oh, superhero punch. Grabbing the leg, trying to capture a tree. Follow to a two. And Princess Peach wins it. Princess Peach wins it. No, no way I'm taking it. Really dominant in the first first single match in some time. Princess Peach got it. On our next round to a tag team match. Next pay per view, glory. Here we go, match two of the night, ladies and gentlemen. Team Mario coming down first. In the three time tag team champions. One, two Legion, one. Main car. <laughs> Team Mario. So they're walking down, Dave. Mario, multi time tag team champion. All over. Any CAW had him as the tag team champion with his brother Luigi. Now in a more of a manager, as a manager.
team pop was the Halloween Saint with Mario in the in the outside being the manager of the, of the up and coming team. Wow. The boat teams are two time a three time tag team champions. We do the FCW Odyssey or Legion titles. Double cut buster. Oh, strength of coke throwing crew around the ring. Modify DDT. Jabs here from the man with the metal claws. Off the ropes, knocking Pepsi down. Oh, into a face blaster. Oh, going for a submission move. And that's it by tap out. Kruger and Vorhe are the number contenders. Whoa. How Team Pop have fallen. Two time Legion Titan Champions. I believe a one time FCW Titan Champions. Defeat with a kick to the face and a submission move. Jabba's to the stars. Wow, I was expecting so much more from Team Pop and Halloween Saints with, with, with their previous history. But Halloween Saints still getting the overhand. No, a Valkyrie title shot. Raven and Starfire. Raven is the challenger. Starfire, who won that title last week. Plates haven't been seen, I saw. Hopefully the two who were former uh, near long, year, nearly year-long tag team champions going for the separate goals. Still wearing the Titan logos, still a part of the Titans. Starfire for the first time winning the world title. Sweet and sour, I think the team should be called. The challenger, Supergirl, who last week defeated She Hulk by counting. Didn't win the belt though, can't win the belt by counting. She wants another shot at that title, she needs to prove it. Earn it. Fifteen-minute time limit on this one. There's the bell, and it begins with a straight kick to the face. Raven is a former Valkyrie champion, but she will have to defeat She-Hulk. Which would not be an easy feat. Oh, roll back, but stands right up with it. And again, throws her back, but again, roll backs to her feet. And one more time. Raven. 
Ah, oh, Bronco Booster. <laughs> Only someone who was in the year of Vince could get away with that move. European uppercut. Oh, using the legs for advantage. Standing leg drop. A handstand leg and drop. Oh, knee to the side of the face. And again, another knee. Three knees to the head of Supergirl. Well, that into a triangle lock. Goes for a neck breaker onto Raven. Over oh. DDT. Oh, spike DDT. Dropping her head right in the canvas. Slow rollover. Pin follow 10. See what we have. The Kryptonian kicks out of it. How about into this submission move? Well, many a match with this move, but Supergirl rolls out of it. It's not her first day. Roll into a hurricane. Drop kick button down. Raven reverses that one into the corner. Ooh. Ankle. Curve around a or Frankenstein. And a boot knocking Raven to the floor. Those pinfall attempt. Only a two. Triangle lock. Up on our feet. Gives back. Body slam. Off the ropes. Off the ropes. Oh, sliding leg drop. Oh. The leg moves come from Raven. Kicks, submissions, leg drops. Going for a pinfall. Didn't get it done. Just waiting for it. Oh, I've got now grabbing her, going for a submission. Oh, but super immediately rolls, rolls through it. Russian leg sweep. Everyone after the arm of Raven. Pinfall attempt. Only a one. Oh, go for a run. Oh, Is that a modified power bomb? Backwards bomb. Staff hard. New champion Super Supergirl last week could have done it. 
Gantron, Raven from the top, Raven former tag team champion, former Valkyrie champion. I'd like to try it one more time. Road to glory has passed, it's glory is next. Fight next up is glory. This is fantastic move. Putting Supergirl down. Oh, there's Supergirl's back up that dude. Ugh, hangman on the ropes. And only a two. Two of these bow water. I wouldn't say myself who I think deserves it more. A <laughs> third. As Ram Extron Zintas. There's the submissions locked in. And Raven is your number contender for She Hulk's Valkyrie title. At glory. This match, probably the longest match so far of the card tonight. Tired of being tag team champions, tag team single reigns about to happen. Main event time, ladies and gentlemen. Number one contender shop is Matt as well. So far, we saw Peace Peaches, Princess Peach defeat Spoiler. We saw the Halloween Saints become number one contenders for the Tag Team Champions at Glory. And we just saw Raven defeat Supergirl to become number one contender for the Valkyrie title. And there he is, coming in first. It was only a week ago. This day last week, he lost the FCW World title his fifth reign after only 70 plus days to Spider Man. He is still the 2021 20, King of Kings. Two belts, Red Hood. This match is the face Spider Man. No, there's no just instant re rematches. Unless the champ asks for what you saw. Kevin White recently asked the face Gene Grey once again, but Gene Grey is now the Odyssey Women's Champion. Comes the first challenge, second challenger for the number one match. Nate Gray, formerly originally debuted with Bishop and Cable. Them two now have been released. He's by himself. The X Man, as they some call him. Golden shower around them.
now finally the man who should be a super should be the Superman Varro Zod Paul Heyman had many things to do with him last time but did nothing he has fought for the Superman name he failed long ago facing Superman 2 to win the world title and the name and lost he's Varro Zod he dresses as the Superman he is from Earth 2 20 minute time limit. Painful submission. First painful submission gets it. And there's is the crowbar. He doesn't even try. Red Hood. He knows the game. He knows he's in triple track. He knows what he's doing. He has to beat each person individually. Or let them beat each other. But he isn't someone who's just gonna walk. And this is his opportunity to get shot back at the title he lost. Rattles odd, Superman. And there is the F5. Red Hood taking out the referee for that one. Oh, pendulum neck breaker. Rattles odd, the Kryptonian showing his strength. Throwing Red Hood across the room. The odd one out is Nate Gray and Mucent. Those are born with the abilities, they happened later in life. Oh, he's picking up Varl's odd. Fireman's carry. Oh, and I go to sleep. And he gets a drop kick at the same time. And that spinning heel kick has helped Red Hood win so many matches. And there's the crowbar, two crowbars. This time, Varl's are down, he's going for a pinfall attempt. Only oh, two, though. Oh, battle ram. Again, manhandled. By Varl's odd. And flip up. Oh, the superhero punch. The Varl's odd. If we going down, I would only get you. Not even a one. Big old clothesline, emptying the ring, Red Hood, going to the top. Going after the mutant. Oh, and a leg drop. Doesn't get all of it. But enough. Looks like he might have winded himself. Ralzad will be the harder one to defeat. He is the Kryptonian. Boot to the throat and boot to the side of the head. Red Hood. Oh, making a mistake. It's like Varel Zod. Put his ass there. Picking up a pinfall. Oh. The spear and he catches him. The veteran catches him into a <laughs> DDT. Takes Nate Gray down. I uh, uh, goes for the crowbar. Gets nowhere and jab. It's said. Stunner, stunner. Varalzad with a high knee to Nate Gray. Varalzad, will he rob the pinfall attempt? Will he rob it? No. Nate would have been pissed if he took out a former champion and to lose it to someone else, stealing it. And this time he gets red out of everything. You need to capitalize and take the pinfall. Pinfall going. One, two. Oh, and red Hood kicks out of it.
I think I see signs of blood on right now. <laughs> Spin and heel kick. Round lot is down. <sighs> Neck break of the Nate Gray. Not going for the Ralzard pinfall attempt, going for Nate Gray. More of, not the obvious one. Oh, the challenge. Oh, Ralzard comes back with a clothesline, putting Red Hood down. So I was on blood game, a lot of strength, but not enough to put former five time champion. Jawbreaker. Ah, oh, drop kick the vows odd. Oh, Nate Ray trying to hot dog. Grandstand goes nowhere. And he's going to get a power bomb. And it's a pinfall attempt. Now, pin. I now turn into a long leg Boston Crab. Will Nate Ray hold out? Could he be saved by Valzard? Valzard's back in the ring. And that's it. Red Hood will be facing Spider Man at Glory. I've been your host, Old Man. It's H. Old Man. Till next time, take care. Goodbye. See you.